Czech, congratulations on your first league start. How would you assess this afternoon? Um, personally, it was. A, I think I played well. Um, I was calm, collected before the game. I wasn't too nervous. I was just excited to get out there and make my debut, um, to play in front of Matty and obviously the fans as well. The fans were amazing, by the way. Um, but in the end, we didn't get away with um, the three points. So we should have got something from that game, but unfortunately, unfortunately, we didn't. But we just we just got to move on to the next and. Yeah, just move on and keep our heads up because we actually played well today, I think. It didn't get off to the ideal start conceding after seven minutes, but it was a fantastic response from the lads. Yeah, when you concede, you've got to keep your head up. Um, it was We conceded early, so we had we had a lot of time to get a goal back, um, which we did straight, straight away. So, yeah, we just kept our heads up, um, stayed confident and we got a goal back. And that, that shows good character and... Yeah, sometimes that happens. You just got to deal with it and move on. You said when you returned that the point of contact was the thing that you've improved most at Truro. You were fantastic today in winning every header. Yeah, I've been ever since I signed for XR when I was 16. That's what I've been working on with the coaches. Um, Matty's big on that with his centre halves. Um, obviously, at first I wasn't too good at it. I can't lie, but as the years went on, you know, and playing against better players, you start learning and getting better at doing that so I think I'm getting very well at, at doing that but you've always got you've always got room for improvement and I think I can improve even more on, on my heading so yeah. You pulled up with a touch of cramp is that just the physicalities of League 2 football compared to non-league? Yeah it's, it's completely different to be fair like you're playing against proper athletes as well people as fit as you um, the intensity was high in that game it, it was 1-1 both teams were trying to get a goal so, yeah, I just cramped up a bit. It shouldn't be nothing too major. I just got to go home and eat a lot of food. Um, my mum's gonna cook me some nice, some nice African food. So that should that should do the trick. But yeah, um, I just want to make sure that I'm available for Tuesday and Friday as well. And I just want to keep on playing games. Yeah, so it was a loss tonight, which is always disappointing. But there's plenty of positives from across the board about tonight's performance. Yeah, we played well. We played well as a team. Um, you know, a lot of our a lot of the, the week has been disjointed, um, like Matty said, not a lot of people training, but you know, we, we stick with it. Um, Stubbsy as well, um, getting 90 minutes, you know, that's great for him after being out for a year and getting 90 minutes there and um, playing the whole game, that's excellent for him. Um, and that's just football, sometimes you win some, you lose some, um, and we just got to move on and keep our heads up. We've got a game on Tuesday, now we've got to look forward to that and then after Tuesday on Friday, and then the next games that are coming up. So Jordan replaced you after 65 minutes. Is that a partnership that you're looking to in the future? Yeah, me and Jordan played with each other in my first year scholar. Um, and we got a very tight friendship, I'd say. Um, Jordy's been at this club ever since I signed, so we're very close, yeah. Um, we play well together, we play well together. We know what, we know our strengths, we know our, weak, our weaknesses, and we play well together. We've got, we've got a good chemistry, so um, yeah, I'd love to play with Jordy in the future. I'd love to. Um, that we'll just have to see in it. Yeah. And finally, it was a sellout away fans. I mean, they it was, there was still an applaud at the end of the game. They were still there supporting in numbers. They were fantastic today, weren't they? Yeah, it was my first time that like, experiencing that. Do you know what I mean? Um, I've never experienced something like that as well. Um, the fans were amazing. Uh, they were the away fans, but they were making the most noise. Um, yeah, they're, they're, they're brilliant, you know, always sticking with us, always cheering us on. You know, travelling from Exeter to Sutton, that's, that's a very long way, do you know what I mean? Um, so I want to say thank you to all the fans that came down and supported us and just keep on supporting us as well, yeah. Fantastic. Cheers, Jack. Cheers.